Southport, a small seaside town in the northwest of England, home to around 90,000 people. During the winter months, the town is quiet, but come summer, the town becomes a popular tourist hotspot. Southport Lifeboat or Southport Offshore Rescue Trust was established in 1840, but disbanded in 1925. In 1988, after many men lost their lives on the Southport coast, a decision was made to reintroduce the lifeboat service. Southport Lifeboat Station was located 380 metres from the beach slipway, which makes for quick and easy launchings in an emergency. The lifeboat station is unmanned until a call comes in in which local volunteers who live and work within close radius rush to the boathouse to respond to the call. Southport Lifeboat costs £60,000 a year to maintain and be on standby when needed. The money goes on equipment and training to ensure the crew and the equipment are reliable and ready for any time of day. Funding mainly comes from the Southport Lifeboat charity shop, around two miles from the boathouse. They sell household items that have been donated to the shop. I'm Kath Wilson, and I'm the manager of the shop. I started the shop about 10 years ago to try and build a new lifeboat house. And all the money we've raised has gone towards buying the new boat, the little boat, and towards the new lifeboat build. Southport Lifeboat has lots of equipment to their disposal. The main lifeboat, the Heather White, was purchased in 2006 after years of fundraising. The boat carries a crew of four and can be driven in four seven to eight gales thanks to 250 horsepower engines. The lifeboat can be launched within 10 minutes of the pager going off and can travel at speeds of 50 miles an hour up to 25 miles off the Southwark coast. I spoke to the coxswain, the man in charge, and asked him why he's on the local lifeboat. Hello, I'm Keith Porter, I'm the senior coxswain at Southport Lifeboat. I've been doing the lifeboat crew in for 28 years. Um, we do it because we like to assist people and it uh, gives you a good feeling if you, get, if you help somebody who's in difficulty. Due to Southport's coastline containing hidden mud, Southport Lifeboat also specialises in mud rescue. I joined the lifeboat on one of their training exercises where they showed me the equipment they use for getting people out of the mud. Twenty sixteen was the biggest year for the Southport Lifeboat as they received thirty two call outs, more than any other year. In December two thousand and sixteen, Southport Lifeboat became a charity of the cooperative and was featured on their Christmas advert. This brought in more funding to the lifeboat and keeps it enabled to carry out the important job they do. <laughs>